What's up you guys, it's your girl Diana and today I have a huge fall haul for you. Say hello to Mia. Every time I try and film she wants to say hello. So here she is. She's huge now. She's almost 40 pounds. She's gonna be a big dog. But yeah, so I'm gonna show you where I spent all my money for the past uh, month. Actually I bought everything in like two days. So don't judge me. I haven't been shopping in a while. But yeah, so we got Amazon. We got Home Goods. I guess TJ Maxx. Uh, Forever 21, we got it all fam, the real real. So if you'd like to see me spend all my money and live vicariously through me and make better choices yourselves because you're not going to spend this much money on clothing, then just keep on watching and if you like videos like this, make sure you subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more hauls like this. And yeah, let's just uh, get into this. Oh my goodness, hello, yes, child, come here. Look at how big she is now. Mwah. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. She's also a lot nicer to me now. She actually likes me now. She didn't like me at first. She's like, dad more. <gasps> you want all the attention. I'm not gonna go in any particular order, but the first thing that I see is these. Ew, what is on these? Oh no, I got these dirty already. It was like some crusty white those but the first thing that I see in my bag oh my god it's literally all over them is my uh, Chanel loafers these are from the real real so they are consigned it's not all about you ma'am you're gonna have to chill uh, they're consigned obviously uh, I got them in a size 35 and a half so they're five and a half and yeah they're just a like, cute little staple Chanel loafers this is probably the most expensive thing I have in this haul they were like say like $200. Uh, the next shoe item, which I also see on top of everything, so uh, my clothes are probably all dirty now, is these little like sock sneakers. I didn't want to, honestly, I didn't want to spend the money on the Balenciagas. I just kind of like the way that they look. So I just went for some like similar looking ones that I got off of Amazon. They were like $25. So definitely a good steal. They literally look exactly the same. And they're really comfy. I like sportswear, so some little sock sneakers. Are these even still a thing, or am I like way too late to the game? Probably way too late to the game, but I plan on styling these. Oh, also, this isn't a try-on haul, but I am going to film a like styling video. I'm gonna style a lot of the clothing, or basically all the clothing that I bought in that video, so subscribe to make sure you see that video when it comes out. Next, next up, oh, maybe this is from? Home Goods. It is this really cute little, uh, what do you call this, coat? Yeah, I suppose it's like a fall coat. It's not like a winter coat, it's like super light. Um, it's the brand Carolina Belle from Montreal. No clue. Got it in a size small. They had a bunch of them at TJ Maxx, or mine is like a TJ Maxx slash Home Goods, it's like both combined. But yeah, so this one is really cute. It's soft, it's like checkered, so it's very fall themed, and the inside is like super soft as well. It's like a weird silk kind of lining. But yeah, I thought that'd be really cute for fall. She was $39.99 at TJ Maxx compared to $60. So, you know, we got $20 savings there. Thanks, TJ Maxx. Next up, all right, so this is all from Forever 21. I'm streaming. It's all in that bag. Okay, first up, I honestly, I don't know if people are still gonna wear these next year or this year, but I love the way these look on me. It's one of those little like uh, cabbie hats or like, what do you, what do they call them? Mail boy hats? I don't even know. I just got it in this like green color. It's got this little braiding detail and then the little side has like little silver buttons and then the little bill part is leather. It's from Forever 21, like I said. This guy was $12.99. I don't know, I just think these are really cute. And I think that they just like spice up your outfits. Oh, what's my ear doing? This guy was really cute when I tried them on. Yeah, friends a little small. I don't know if they have sizes, probably not, but I guess I just have a big head. Did I just ruin my hair? Comment down below if I ruin my hair because I won't be able to see this until I edit it. Oh! We have a third pair of shoes in here. Obviously, I am obsessed with shoes. Uh, so these shoes were also from Forever 21. Uh, I'm short, so I love platform shoes. They're just like these little platform, like, they kind of remind me of like the Stan Smith 
um, Adidas. They are a size six. I don't think they sell. I usually don't find like anything smaller than a six at Forever 21, but they're a size six. They just have this little green stripe on the side. You know, they got a little Gucci vibe going on. And they were $24.90. And they are like a pleather material. Oh my god, there's like some crusty stuff on here. Gotta clean these two apparently. Why aren't all my shoes crusty? What's happening? But yeah, cute little white sneaks, little green stripe. They also had some with like a red stripe on the side, but I like the green a little more. Yeah, and their platform. So they help a short girl, you know, survive. Uh I also got these pair, this pair, these pair, okay. Good English, Diana, you went to college. Uh, this pair of white uh, socks, they're kind of like um, calf socks and they just have these little stripes and they say blanc on them, so French for white. And I just thought those were really cute. These were $3.90, nice little staple. I love high socks, so had to get a pair of those. Next up, uh, I got a pair of really cute jeans in a size 25 this is like the smallest size i could find uh hopefully they fit because forever 21 sizes run a little weird so sometimes like 25 is too big on my waist because i have a smaller waist but 25 is like what i usually buy they look pretty small so hopefully they fit um they were 24.99 and they just have like that little frayed part at the bottom and then they just got some rips on like the knees and stuff uh, I'm gonna hopefully be able to wear these normally because I'm a midget and so I'm, I've always been scared to like try this trend out because I'm like, oh, they're gonna be too long. So in my styling video, we'll see if they work out. Next up, uh, not sure how everyone feels about this like trend. My dad, I showed him these and he said I look like a farmer, but you know, we're gonna try and make it work. It's a pair of just like black, kind of like distressed um, overalls and then they just have like the high waist thing, which is nice. And they're the skinny ones. Cause honestly, your girl is never gonna be into mom jeans. I have thick thighs and a big booty. So we're gonna stick to the skinnies. They're more flattering on your girl. Uh, I just got these in a size small and they were $34.90 and they're really soft and stretchy feeling. So I thought they'd be cute. And we're gonna style them with maybe some booties, a little hat. Yeah, make it a little more girly because, you know, why not? Next up, I have this little windbreaker. It's like a cropped windbreaker. I think I got it in a medium because they didn't have it in a small. And I'm really impatient, so I don't like ordering things online if I'm already in the store. So just got it in a medium. It's gonna be a little oversized, got a little hood. And it's just in this like color block pattern. It's got like tan and black and a little bit of white on the sleeves. Thought it would be good for the rainy days or if I want to go on a morning run with the Mia. So like that. I'm literally just putting it in a pile next to me. So rip that, put this over. And then I also, for the days that I'm feeling like a, like a girl, I got this little dress. It's like a little, um, it's like a little black like jersey dress, but it's got like rib material and then it's got a little collar for if I ever want to be really girly one day. I got this in the girls section because the Forever 21 dresses in the women's section, like even the size smalls tend to fit me really big just because they're meant for like taller people. Like I'm literally one foot tall. So this was $14.99. I got it it's like the biggest size you can get for girls, like 13, 14. So we'll see how this works out. Next bag, another home goods bag. Oh, so from this home goods trip, I only got like two things. I got this, uh, just this plain, like gray. Oh, there's a thing in there. It's not letting me expand it, but there's this, just got this gray, like, uh, it's kind of, it kind of feels like a windbreaker. It's like not like a normal, like material hat, but I thought it was really cute, like the color. You know, $7.99 from TJ Maxx. Um, next up, oh, in love. So, over here. Honestly, I'm a huge nerd, so whenever I see anything that reminds me of my childhood, I'm just like, gotta get that real quick. So um, I saw this tie-dye Sonic the Hedgehog shirt at River 21, and I had to get it. This was literally what I grew up watching. I would watch it every Saturday morning. I've seen like almost every single version of it from like the really OG ones to like Sonic X or whatever, which I was not a fan of, but can't wait for that movie to come out. Hopefully they fixed the graphics 
Son Sonic the Hedgehog because that was really scary when that trailer came out. I was very upset. So, yeah, we got a Sonic the Hedgehog shirt. It's tie-dye. Probably going to be like a sleep shirt for me. Really cozy, but soft. Next up, oh, another nostalgia piece. Oh, by the way, this Sonic the Hedgehog shirt, if we're also some nerds are watching, was $19.90 and I got it in a small. Um, the next nerdy thing that I got, true to me, Pokemon, bright red, because I love, I honestly, I got it because it was red and I love the way that red looks on me. Uh, so I just got this red Pokemon shirt. It just has all the OG Ash Pokemon. It's got Squirtle, it's got Bulbasaur, Charmander, and your boy Pika. And then I got this in a size small as well, and it is $14.99. Also very soft, also probably won't be a sleep shirt or a gym shirt. Next up, honestly, this was just a staple piece. It was $9.90. It's literally just a white t-shirt. Why can I not find the top? There it is. A white t-shirt. All these are from her. Uh, white t-shirt the only thing that's kind of cool about it is it's got this little roll on the sleeve so it kind of looks like you tried a little harder so i thought that'd be really cute tucked into some uh jeans probably those rich jeans that i showed you earlier wow true to diana fashion i bought those same jeans but in a different color because i thought they were cute okay so this is where we're we're gonna hope and pray that this fits my waist they didn't have a 25. so i bought 26 which i've never seen a size 26 i thought they only went by odd numbers but they're literally the exact same jeans. They have like the rips and then they have the little fray at the bottom. Uh, they're a size 26. I don't know what that translates to, honestly, but hopefully this fits my waist. This is kind of sketching me out. Because yeah, tiny waist strut and big booty strut. And these are $24.99 as well. And then the last thing in this bag is, I, got, I found this shirt randomly. It's a size large, it's $14.99. And it just says heaven sent on the collar. It's kind of reminds me of like the easy like season one outfit. It's got like the rips in it. Or it kind of reminds me of like a boy's shirt. Like I feel like Jay would wear a shirt like this or have some shirt like this. My the <laughs> words. But yeah, so I thought it was, it was really soft. It's honestly why I got it. And I liked the color. It was like this um, cream color, which I thought was nice. So yeah, so that is everything in my bag. Oh, I almost forgot. So my last item is actually this sweater that I'm wearing. It's a kid see ghosts sweater. It says lucky me, I see ghosts. Um, for those of you that don't know, it says free on the sleeve. And it's just got this big old logo over here. Um, and on the back, it says can't flog off. Um, for those of you that don't know, it's a uh, Kid Cudi and uh, what's his face Kanye West collab merch thing from Camp Vlognaw because they came out with the song Ghost Town, which is one of my favorite songs. I honestly, you know, it's really cozy. Got it in a size large, and I figured I would just fangirl. So here we are. It's honestly kind of late because that song came out a really long time ago but I saw this online and your girl had to buy it. I literally bought this a month ago so it came in yesterday and I was like oh, in time for the haul so I thought I would wear it and yeah so that is everything in this haul. Oh Mia is waking up so good thing we are done. Hello my love you are back. Right so that was my huge Paul, uh, stay tuned for the styling video where I'm going to show you how I style everything that I just showed you. Stay tuned if you want to see more of Mia. I know you can kind of see her right now. She can say hello again. And yeah, I love you guys. And I'll see you in my next video. Mwah! Bye!